bottom of it. You know I like when you rest at the top of it. She wants your name, you need the yo yo. I'm only doing cash, guys, don't need promo. I pull up to the high rise, I'm in the full fall. Hey, vlog. Um, it's Diamond. If you are new here, I go by Diamond Forever. And today I'm coming at you guys with a vloggy vlog. Um, it's Friday. I just got off work not too long ago and I'm getting ready to go out with my friends. Hence is why I'm at my lab. This is, I'm in the lab right now getting ready to do my makeup. And I gotta hurry up because it's 9.44 and I'm supposed to be meeting people at 10.30. So, not sure how that's gonna work but we gonna make it do what it do so i'm sitting here doing my makeup i was gonna like really try to beat my face because i thought i had time to do that and then i was gonna put on a really cute outfit because i thought i had time to do that and then i was gonna do like change the part in my hair and everything because i thought i had time to do that but i don't have time to do none of this so I feel like I haven't vlogged in forever. I know it's because I tend to be vlog every other weekend, but I also work every third weekend. So how it'll go is I'll vlog one weekend. So I'll be off work, vlog one weekend. I'm off work the next weekend too, but I don't vlog. And then the next weekend is supposed to be my vlog weekend, but I'm working. So I literally have nothing to vlog. So then it turns into me having to vlog the next weekend and then the capital, uh, um, and then the cycle just repeats itself. And so that's why I feel like I, every time I vlog, I feel like I haven't vlogged in forever. And then I really don't know what I'm gonna wear because y'all, it's cold. We gonna make it do what it do. I'm gonna stop talking. Um, Cause like I told y'all, I'm running late. Even though I'm doing a pretty good job multitasking, I'm doing a lot better job than I thought I would be doing. But yeah, cause I gotta meet my friend pretty soon. And I have nothing done, so I'm gonna stop talking to y'all and I will try to show you guys my outfit and all of that stuff when I am done. Can't make any promises, but I'll really, really try. Really, really quick outfit of the day and you guys probably can't even see me well. I just have on this, um, it is a little bodysuit. That's my perfume. This bodysuit I got from Shein. I have on these jeans I got from Rue 21, I think. And then I have on these boots. I don't know where I got them boots from. I think it was Blooming Gills. I did not get a chance to curl my hair, but this is my makeup. Don't look too bad. Yeah, I look cute. And then I have on this little bag from Shein as well. And then that's what I'm wearing tonight. And I'll see you guys. I'm super, super, super late. Okay guys, so it's 2 a.m. And this is how I'm looking at the end of the night. We stopped and we got pizza. Well, we walked to get pizza and y'all, it's cold outside. So the fact that we walked to get pizza is kind of beyond me. But the place we went to, I'm gonna try to tell y'all about it in the morning when I, if I remember, but yeah, it was a good night. Hold on, let me get Bentley situated. But um, I'm just finna take a, not take a nap. What am I talking about? Oh Lord. I'm about to, and my lashes look good. I'm just about to take a back shower, eat my pizza and get in the bed. And it's going to be a good night. And whew, I'm going to talk to y'all in the morning. Ain't nobody ever gave me shit with this big tip I had to get paid. And this tank game going stay. And you know the trees getting laid. Baby, welcome to the party. I'm off the money is in the lean. That's why I'm over retarded. That's why I'm over retarded. Baby, welcome to the party. Uh, I hit the boy up and then I go skate in Rory. Baby, welcome to the party.
Hi Yoga, this is a little sports bra from, where I get this from? Fabletics. These shorts are from Marshalls. This sports bra has matching leggings with it, but I didn't feel like wearing them today. And then y'all know I just got on my sandals and then I have my towel, my water. Didn't do nothing crazy to my hair because it's about to get sweated out. Like even if I try to mold it down, the product is just gonna sweat and it's just gonna get in my eyes and burn. And so I don't worry about none of that. If I was running to like a quick store afterwards, which I thought about doing, but if I was doing that, then I would bring a hat and just put my hat on after I leave the hot yoga studio. But I'm just coming straight home, so I'm not worried about that. I'm just about to fill up my water bottle, get me a little granola bar and be out the door. So I'm in the car, I'm getting ready to leave the house a little bit later than expected because I had to situate Bentley. Um, I put him in his crate, which I've been doing for the last almost two years that I've had him. Well, it ain't been almost two years, it's been a year and a half that I've had him, but he's always been crate trained, never mind his crate. But lately, he's been like really barky. And usually he'll bark a few times when I put him in there and he'd be done. The whole time I was down there, he was barking nonstop. I was like, let me get him situated. So I just put, ended up putting him in the bathroom, which is annoying because when I put him in the bathroom, I have to take all the stuff off the floor, like my rugs and stuff. I have to take the toilet paper out of the toilet roll. I have to take all the towels off the racks because he'd be pulling them down. I have to I just have to rearrange a lot when I'm putting him in the bathroom hopefully my next place will have like two bathrooms or at least an area big enough that I can like put a playpen up for him or something and so I won't have to go through that every morning but this will be working with right now I'm gonna have yoga for a little minute so before the what we gonna call it today before the paranormal they used to offer both 60 minute and 80 minute classes and so for the same price and so you could just pick what you wanted but after the paranormal they like had to cut down on a lot of stuff like at one point they shut down as well but um when they weren't shut down they did have to um cut down on a lot of stuff and then also you know different other other safety measures like distancing and stuff like that and so they've slowly but surely kind of gotten back to normal and so now they are offering their um 80 minute classes again and so t this is going to be my first time taking an 80 minute class in probably like two years and i'm nervous because an extra 20 minutes of working out may not sound like a big deal but baby it's <laughs> I know it's gonna be brutal because it's the first time I've done it like high yoga is a different kind of workout I don't know it's a different kind of workout yeah I'm excited though um yeah I just re-upped on my 30 what is it three month membership so for three months I have unlimited classes um I did it before not too long ago and I really liked it because it made me like really want to get my money's worth in it and so I was going like very frequently and so now I decide I'm gonna do, go like even harder, especially because I haven't been going to the actual gym anymore. I really wanna go like even harder. And so I've been going like pretty much every day unless I physically can't go a day because it's not like the gym where you can go at any time, you know. High yoga, there's classes, so you can only go when there's a class scheduled to go. So if I physically like, if my schedule physically doesn't match up with theirs then i won't go of course but if it matches up i'm going but yeah i'm gonna get my water in i ain't drank no water all morning so i'm gonna chug some water before i go in here and then just get my mind right i'm probably gonna listen to scissor good days because that baby that's my song especially when i'm coming or leaving high yoga scissor good days is my song so i'm probably gonna listen to that i literally have two minutes until i get there though so maybe not the whole song but yeah this is how i'm looking post yoga yeah it was a good class and look at this my i didn't already burnt i burned 583 active calories and 693 total calories in there yeah, i picked up a package from the least office i'll show y'all what i got it ain't nothing crazy it's just something yeah it ain't nothing crazy and then I really don't know what else the day has in store for me, but we will definitely see. We'll see how it goes. Um, 
and yeah, I'll keep y'all posted. That's why I'm over Me and Bentley were back from our walk. Had a nice little walk. Um, what else is going on? Um, I'm about to eat some pizza. I heated up some pizza from last night and then I'm going to take a little nappy nap. Um, I decided I'm allowing myself naps on weekends because I was really struggling with do I want to take a nap and then relax now or do I just want to get everything I want to get done done and then relax the whole night? I decided to take a nap now because the bills do now not later anyway <laughs> and then when I get up I, oh I put some laundry I put a load of laundry in I only had one load look at me whoop, whoop. so I put a load of laundry in and then when I get up I'm gonna get to cleaning and get to doing my toes and oh I don't think I told you I did my nails and I did them with the dip and I did no tip or anything and they look so cute and natural like don't get me wrong I may go back to my tip but I didn't do the tip this time because my nails had finally gotten long enough to where I didn't like absolutely positively need one like don't get me wrong it's still short a little too short for my liking but I feel like they're going to grow and then also with the tips I feel like the tips just add another possibility they they just i feel like the tips add in more room for error if that makes sense i'm gonna do the same color on my toes there's the color y'all can see it and then if y'all want to know where uh the exact dip powder set i got let me know and i'll let y'all know um i'm trying to think what else is going on okay y'all it's like much later i got a little white head on my lip but it's much later it's almost nine o'clock I've been up for a little minute. I got up at like 6, 6.30. I'm gonna try to maybe film tomorrow, get some pictures tomorrow, stuff like that. So I do things kind of backwards because I usually do that type of stuff on Saturday and then Sunday is the day that I like to relax and deep clean. But I don't know, I, today I just felt like chilling. So I, that's what I did. So that happened. Um, I have high yoga tomorrow and then after high yoga, I'll probably run in Kohl's real quick. Or I may come home, do my makeup and all that stuff. Then I'm gonna run to Kohl's after I like take some pictures and like maybe film a video. I wanna try to maybe film a video tomorrow. We'll see how that goes. Like, we'll see. And then um, I was on FaceTime with my sisters for a real long time. That's why I didn't check in with y'all earlier because I was on FaceTime with them for a minute. We was just chatting it up, talking about our trip coming up. We're really excited about our trip. It's gonna be our first like sister's trip. So my toes are done. And now it's time to get this rooms clean so tomorrow I can wake up. Even though y'all, I almost don't even wanna clean this room. Maybe I'll clean the rest of the house, but not my room because I know tomorrow once i do my makeup and find an outfit and take pictures it's going to be a mess in here all over again so why even set myself up for that type of failure that's kind of how i'm feeling tomorrow i also really want to edit some videos at least to get this one video edited and posted tomorrow but i would love to edit multiple videos tomorrow so that's gonna be my goal for tomorrow i want tomorrow to be like a very productive day like don't get me wrong today was fine just fine i had a great day but tomorrow i want it to be super 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 productive so we gonna try for that um and then yeah i don't know if y'all see me the rest of the night because like i said i'm just gonna clean and stuff so nothing fun um but i will definitely see y'all tomorrow my candle for my bathroom tonight is cypress rainforest i'm pretty sure i got this from big lots and we got breathe island cotton and i got this from marshall's on clearance i think this is six dollars 
Y'all know I love me some Marshall's candles. Okay guys, so it's like 11 o'clock at night now and um, I'm only gonna try to clean for like another hour because I do have to get up um, kind of semi early for hot yoga tomorrow. Hot yoga starts at nine, but I like to leave the house like by 8.30 just cause I like to get there early and like make sure I have my spot. I got a special spot I like and when I don't get my spot, I be a little bit. So I try to get there as early so I can get my spot. And then, so I do wanna get up by like eight so I can be ready by like 8.30 to leave the house. And so I wanna be in bed, like get my eight hours, even though at this point, I'm just gonna accept that I'm a six hour girl because it doesn't matter how early I get in the bed. I always end up just not going to bed. So, okay y'all, so it's almost 12, it's not quite 12. I think it's like, hold on, let me pause my cover, I'm a neek. Y'all haven't really seen much of Bentley's face. Y'all just seen his booty when he been walking to this vlog. Say, hey Bentley. Bentley, say hey to the people. But yeah, it's 11.45 and I am done cleaning for the night. I finished my, um. <laughs> I finished my bathroom, my room, except for putting away laundry. I'll do that tomorrow or Monday. I'm not really in a big rush to put get the laundry put away. So either tomorrow or Monday, I'll do that. I cleaned my living room. It's smelling good in there. I vacuumed. I straightened up the pillows. That's really all that needed to be done in there. Literally was straighten up the pillows and vacuum. And then I did have to change a wallflower in my living room and in my guest bathroom. So I did that. That took like... 10 minutes max but um i'm gonna take a nice hot shower i can't wait to get in this water it's gonna feel so good and then i'm gonna rub my body down get all smelling good moisturized and all of that y'all know the vibes and then we gonna head to bed i'm tired and i've got a lot of stuff done today it's gonna be it's good it's been a good day and tomorrow will be a good day as well we're gonna speak it into existence manifest it and yeah i will see y'all tomorrow Good morning guys, it's almost 8.30 a.m. Sunday morning and I am getting ready to walk out the door and go to hot yoga. Um, let me show you guys my outfit for hot yoga. Find this stuff on the floor, is carpet freshener and then a little chew toy for Bentley back there. I can't point to it, but yeah, so this is what I'm wearing. Um, I got this set, well actually my friend Maya bought me this set. It's from Wolven, the company W-O-L-V-E-N. And if I'm not mistaken, I remember it saying something about it being made from like recyclable material. Some, I, I can't remember, but definitely check them out. It's a very comfy set. Um, it is a little more busy than I would usually wear, but I still like it. The sports bra has like a little cutout right here. And then the pants, just, I look real snatched in these. And then this is how I'm looking. Y'all always look real snatched and like, sucked in at the beginning of the morning like this isn't even me sucking nothing in this is this is me this is real this is me this is exactly who i'm supposed to be but in the more as the day goes on i just get like i pop out more and more and y'all i had told myself i wasn't going shopping shopping today but tell me why victoria's secret just sent the perk of the month and it's 30 percent off one item which that's not even that big of a deal but then they also are having like their two for 40, um, like the, the bedazzle striped panties and their two for 40. And then you can also get a garter belt. So, and then, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do my two. I may just do one pair of panties because I didn't know the panties was only $25. So I may just do one pair of panties or I may get a panty and garter belt or I may get two pair of panties, I don't know. And then I also wanna get a bedazzled the bedazzle strapped bra because those are like $80 and then if I get a 30% off one item which I have a coupon for 30% off one item and so I'm gonna have a little set because I guess that's why I never knew the panties was only $25 because I've always wanted to buy them in a set so the bra is like $80 for a little change of events, I'm actually wearing my brown Tory Burch sandals because they go with my outfit a little better. I could have wore black, I guess, but I don't know. The brown do go with my outfit. And y'all, here's all my little piggies that I did yesterday. Um, This foot looks better than this foot because this foot, I got to grow my toenail back. But 
hey, I'm trying to talk to the people. But this foot look good. And I'd be, I be okay with this foot looking better because this is the foot my tattoo on anyway. So, like, this foot got to be on point because people going to look at it a little bit more. You know what I mean? So, I'm okay with this foot looking better than this foot. And this is how I'm looking after high yoga. Woo! I can't wait to deep condition my hair to... Ooh, y'all. My hair. First of all, my scalp is itching for models. Ugh. Can't wait to deep condition my hair and wash it. Uh, I may do like an apple cider vinegar treatment too to just really strip it from all that gunk. Okay, so I did take Bentley on a little short walk. We just went around the complex. And so I'm at home. I'm about to make my coffee protein slash nutrition, whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm using, next time I'm going to use the strawberry flavored nutritional shake from Equate. The Equate brand is similar, like I said earlier, to a Boost or an Ensure. But this time I'm not going to use that the whole thing because I think I didn't get enough coffee taste last time. So I'm going to do half coffee, half shake. And then I'm just using my cold brew from Starbucks. Black Unsweet. No need for any sugar or cream. It's pretty good. And I'm just going to finish the rest of this. It's a little bit left in here. I'm just going to finish it. I'm about to put on this wig. Um, I didn't let my candles around the house. Ugh, it's a vibe. I'm in a very, very, very good mood. Very good mood. So, I'm about to put on this wig. Same wig I've been wearing for a little bit. This will probably be after I film, because I'm going to change it to a, a middle part. And then after I film a, a video in it, in the middle part, I'm going to be done with it. Of course, I'm going to return back to it, but I'm going to switch up the style after this a little bit. But um, I do want to film in it in the middle part one time for the one time. And y'all probably thinking, how's she finna put this wig on with this uh, busted ponytail? I'm finna do what it do. Uh, Cause I'm not braiding my hair. I'm not, I cannot. I, I can, actually I can, but I'm not. So I'm just going to do two ponytails in the back. Cause if I do one, ooh, I didn't pop my dag on. That's how you know you're hurting. Ugh. And then for adhering my wig, I am using this Even Wonder Lace Bond, y'all. This stuff ain't no joke. I know y'all probably thought TikTok hyped it up. No, it's good. Next time I go back to St. Louis, I'm gonna have to get me some more. I'm gonna have to stock up because like I'm almost, I'm not almost out, but I'm like, I feel like I didn't use half the bottle already because I don't like to sleep in my wigs for real. I will if I have like an early morning, but I don't really like to sleep in my wigs, which means I'm reapplying my wigs pretty much every day. So that's why I've kind of gone through it. But when I go back to St. Louis, I am getting, I'm stocking up on this. They don't have it in the beauty supplies here, of course. Oh, I hate this town. Oh. Y'all, I bought Bentley a new bed because he tore his last one up. And he turned this one up already too, y'all. He likes to hump his beds. And what I don't understand is, can somebody explain this to me? Because I thought once you got a dog neutered, especially if you got him neutered early, and I did get him neutered fairly early, I thought they don't hump after that. Why is my dog still humping? Did that does that mean that they did something wrong? Because I did go to the spay neuter project and pay sixty dollars for it. So if they did, if they cut a couple corners, I'm okay with that. But I just want to know: is are, is he still supposed to be? Is he still supposed to be humping? I just don't think, I thought that was the, I thought that was like one of the reasons people get their dog neutered is to stop humping. But I could be wrong. I don't know nothing about dogs for real, for real. Okay, you guys, so it's two o'clock and I finished my makeup and my hair and and I took pictures in this outfit. Now, y'all know how I wanted to do two makeup, two videos. And when I do a video, when I do a separate video on the same day, I still like to change up my look. Like, of course, I'm going to keep the same hair and makeup. But I do like to change up my outfit for the at least my top usually. But I kind of wanted to go for like a full second look. Like, because I want to take pictures in a full second look. But I don't think that's going to happen because it's already 2 o'clock. 
and I still want to be able to get other stuff done today and I haven't even filmed that first video which it shouldn't take too too long I do have to set up my little filming area and then film it but it shouldn't take too 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 long but then like the process of doing all of that over over again like taking pictures filming again everything I don't think I'm going to be able to do that today which is perfectly fine because y'all I have videos for days like I really when I be trying to film multiple videos a day it's really for fun it's really just because I feel like looking cute I feel like talking I don't need to do it like I have so many videos just they need to be edited and so yeah I'm just gonna try to hurry up and set up my little filming area film this video it shouldn't take too 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 long honestly and so hopefully I can be out the house I already took my picture so hopefully I can be out the house by like three that's the goal so I'm sitting here and I finished filming and I didn't post an Instagram video. I'm literally getting ready to walk out the door to go do what I need to do for the rest of the day. And tell me why my video didn't save. Or I ran out of storage while I was filming. And so what I did was I just, um, the video stopped. It was a 21 minute video clip and it stopped. And so I just went to my recently deleted, I cleared it out. I had plenty of stuff in my recently deleted, so I'm like, okay, I got space now. Continue recording, finish recording. Tell me why I just looked at my, like, draft. I looked at my videos just on a whim, because I don't even usually do that after I finish filming. But I looked at my videos on a whim, and I see that my, the first clip that I filmed was only three minutes. And I'm like, no, that was a 21 minute clip. Any other time I've been in the middle of filming and I've ran out of storage, it still kept the whole clip like it just stopped at the point that I ran out of storage but for some reason this 21 minute clip stopped at three minutes I'm not okay right now <laughs> I'm laughing but I'm not okay I'm not okay so I'm gonna try to figure out what I'm gonna do if there's anything I can do and uh, uh Okay, I just finished refilming the portion that I disappeared, um, but I feel like I feel like I definitely missed some things because it, I did it in 11 minutes. And remember, I told you there was 18 minutes worth of missing footage, so <laughs> something got left out. But it is what it is now. I don't know. Um, yeah, I really ain't even in no good mood no more. I don't know. I was like, I don't know. I just really don't feel the need to go shopping anymore. So maybe I won't do that. Maybe I'll just go straight to the coffee shop, honestly. That's cool with me. Um, So yeah, that'll be good because that'll save me some money. Like I didn't need none of the stuff I was going to pick up anyway. What was I going to pick up? Some candles, didn't need that. I was going to pick up that brown penny set. I kind of want that, but I don't need it. Like I don't need it. I don't, yeah. It's actually good that I had to refilm that video because now I'm just like, I don't even feel like going there. So that's good. That's actually really good. Y'all, look at that. Look at God. Look at God. So I'm going to go on and go to the coffee shop. I've got to figure out which one I want to go to. And this is good because I didn't think I was going to have time to do that. And that's what I really need to do with my life anyway. I ain't need to be shopping no way. So I'm going to figure out which coffee shop I want to go to. And I'll go there for a couple hours and get some stuff done. And then... um. I will see you guys in a minute. It's Sunday, so the vlog is coming to a near end. But I'll see y'all in a bit. This is the perfume of the day. It is Daisy Love Sunshine by Marc Jacobs. I got this a little bit ago. It was one of my first um, big girl purchases. Not the first, but one of the first. <laughs> Hey guys, 
a very unflattering angle but it's me um i just left the coffee shop i had a really good chai tea oh it was so good it was an ice well i know people get in their feelings about the word saying chai tea so i had a really good chai ice chai oh that chai was so good though get home I am going to what I'm gonna do I need to vacuum my room because I was supposed to do that earlier today so I'm gonna vacuum my room oh I'm supposed to clean the kitchen so I'll vacuum my room clean the kitchen I still have plenty of time so I can do all these things vacuum my room clean the kitchen I need to put my makeup up that I just took out to do this makeup and then I'm going to take a nice bath probably if not a bath then a quick shower and then I'm going to cook tonight I'm going to cook asparagus baked chicken and macaroni and cheese baked macaroni and cheese one day I'll show y'all my mac and cheese recipe not today though but yeah that's just the rest of the night that's all I have planned so I guess this is where I leave you guys this is the end of the vlog I guess because I really don't have nothing else to give I've given all I can give so I will definitely see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I had a really good weekend and I hope y'all enjoyed my really good weekend. I had like a really, really, really good weekend. And I didn't even do nothing but them be the best weekends. Well, I guess I went somewhere Friday night. But that um, I had a good Saturday, Sunday too. I've had a great weekend. So um, I hope to see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you did this weekend in the comment section below. And if you made it to the end of this video, because I know you're a trooper if you did, leave me some diamond emojis in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Oh. I just had a lot of pain, but let me tell you